So I want my needle to be facing to the left. I'm going to grab it with my left hand to load it to myself. And notice how I have about a centimeter between the needle hub and my instrument. Okay. So I'm going to cut this about seven inches. Okay. I'm going to load my needle with my again with my left, and I want to see facing to the left. And I want about a cent just about a little bit less than a centimeter of space between that. I'm going to push this in. Now you can focus on the screen. You're on his part now? And I love this. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead, grab my tissue, and really supinate my wrist, and pull through. I'm going to grab my needle here. And it's always easiest if you reload on the tissue. Reloading on the tissue. So I can just come up and go. I'm going to set my tail, I call it. Make sure your tail is short enough. If it's too long, you're going to run into problems. So you want your tail to be about a centimeter. And now I'm ready. I'm going to go ahead and do my next figure. This is like a figure of eight. Push through. Grab with my left. And grab, I'm going to grab the tip of the needle and pull this through. Okay. Now, just like the vaginal cuff is a horizontal line, I want this, the stiffest part of the area is between the needle and the suture. So this is all, and then I'm going to do a wrap. One, and you small movements around the stiff part of the needle. Two. I'm going to go ahead and grab my tail with my left hand. Don't ever let go of that tail. And push this down. The flat knot. There we go. I'm ready to go again. Again, I'm going to go to the stiff part here, nice and parallel. And I'm going to do another wrap. Go down together as a group. Grab my tail. Pull down. Again, it's nice and parallel, and I can change it. As long as this parallel line. I'm going to wrap. I'm going to go ahead and grab my tail. And then the last one, again, I'm going to wrap. Good. Okay, so you don't want to do big movements like this. You want to do tiny movement. So I've done my four ties. You want to do a tiny wrap right around the stiff area. And you want this line to be horizontal to the vaginal cuff. And that's it.